So the news is out. Prime time ah! is headed for the prime time. One of the big major five schools. Yeah. One of the big yeah. uh, big conference. He's going to Colorado mm-hmm. to be the head coach of the Colorado Buffaloes. And it sounds to me like he's leaving for it must be you the know, money. Hey, I, I got mad love for Dion. I met him a couple times, uh, played in a celebrity softball game, Javon Curse back in the day. That's uh, right, he's from right here too. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. And man, awesome guys. You know what I'm saying? I always I only wish the best for him. And I, I'm proud of him, dude. You know, yeah. And I know there's a little controversy about this, this, and that, and Jackson State. And uh, look, anytime you get an opportunity to better yourself and your family, do it. Absolutely. Because I, I promise you that if that company, that situation felt better with a different person in your particular position, they wouldn't have a problem throwing you to the fucking curve and putting that Facts. other person there, dude. And not in a you know, fucking... Not even think about it twice. There has so, been some people dude. that have been upset with Dion because they're idiots. He's he said he wasn't all about the money, but now he's chasing the money. Yeah, he's chasing his well, he, family's it's a future. Better oppo- it's a better opportunity, yeah. not saying and not saying this. This what here's the problem, right? So people, you, you got folks that are mad because he was at HBCU. And I now he's going that. to you a predominantly HBCU is historically black, black college, college and sure. universities. Yep. I understand. That. So he's going to a PWI, which is a predominantly white institution in the University of Colorado. And look at what he did when he was at Jackson. State. Nobody did that before Prime got to uh, Jackson State. So he, you're saying he already did. He did a lot for them. He did a lot. And, and, the, and they were they just went undefeated. Regular, yeah. they, and then they got a bowl game. And then they yeah. had a uh, good season so last he, year. He kind of did what he said he was going to do. He did what he was supposed to do. He did what he, he said. He got the number do. one recruit the year after last year before your uh, year before ago, Travis Hunter. And that then, was going to go to Florida State, and Dion talked him into coming to Jackson State, the number one recruit in the nation. Yeah. And people flipped was tripping like, how did he do it? Don't worry about how he did it. He did it. I would I you would know? think that just because he's t- taking a job here, that doesn't mean he can't help them still. No, see, people are so damn narrow minded. That they don't realize, so he's leaving some of his staff behind, you know, because right. not everybody's going to go to Colorado. Well, right. and but he's a, also bring, another opportunity for his people. Exactly, he's and he's also bringing along other black coaches that can go off and he's get other jobs. So it's like, six, what and, is it, and six he, million gentry? And, and he's, he's listen, going from making three hundred thousand dollars a year is what he was making at Jackson State. That's not bad. Now he's going to be making five point five million dollars a year. That's quite the difference. So, so, although he don't need the money, I he don't, don't think need the money. Man, he needs the money. People that have a lot of money, people are always like, oh, they got a lot of money. I don't. I mean like People that, that have a lot of money have a lot of bills no, no, and, no, and the lifestyle that prime I time I don't mean it like live. that. I'm saying I he don't wants think more money. I don't think the decision was based solely because of the money. I think so. Like, <laughs> I don't think so. Five point five million. And I think he had sure. he the, had his eyes on it. I think he has his eyes on an even bigger prize. I think that he would like to coach, coach one of the teams in the SEC. I think he's gonna be better suited for college athletes. I don't know if his I'm prime uh, will work Mr. with cool. guys that are making just as much money, if not more money, than him. No, uh, it, it, it'll I think work, it'll work because better with no, college no, players. No, he he said he don't want to coach uh, NFL anyway. You know, he don't want to do that. He's been there, done that. But for his college, you know, he's been a very successful college coach, and then they go from Jackson State to a Pac-12 school, and this school. Now, let, think about this. Think about this college primo. game day. <laughs> college game day. I'm thinking about Jackass. Was it came right to now. Jackson State? College Think game. Wherever weird. college game <laughs> day too. goes is a big deal. College game day ain't never been to any FB, HBCUs, and they've been to Jackson State this year. They sure the hell did. And not only that, HBCUs are getting more and more play on on prime, like on ESPN sure. and stuff like that. They weren't really doing that before Prime. So people got to realize, prime, like, oh, yeah, people just need to get out their feelings, shut the F up forever. You know, let him do what he's doing. This man, is everything he's doing is doing for a reason. <laughs> you don't have to understand it. You ain't got to like it. But just sit back and just shut up and let this man do what Somebody's he do. Somebody's always well, going to say thing. something, and they're going to, you know. Well, it was it, only one person, though. It was only one uh, it's, NF, uh, really? ex-ESPN analyst it's, that I saw. It's obvious the it. dude is super driven. I'm sure What other makes you it, think but, that he isn't going to take this opportunity and move forward to a bigger school, Shit, and then I would. eventually take over and be part of the, 
you know, the committee for the NCAA or whatever, some shit like that, and really change shit. Bunch of small minded HBCUs thinking people. And, That's and all it is. They have small saying? minded like, thinking people. He's a good dude. Like, I'm telling you, he probably has huge plans in mind. And I, I wouldn't think that this is going to be his last stop. And now you got the transfer portal, which opened up on oh, Monday. Deion is about to clean up in the transfer portal. He already told his, the, his kids. At Colorado, when he met with them, first day, he's like, look, I'm coming, and a lot of y'all, and I'm bringing some players with me, a lot of y'all ain't going to be here, so y'all might as well hop in the transfer portal. Told him that. Mm. Told him that first day. Because uh, Colorado won one game this year. They went 1-11. and 11. That's not very nice, I don't think. They they need a whole you overall hop change. He's going to go out there and win. De- yeah, De- going to go out there and win. He hey, man, go out there you know what? Watch. I'll tell you what. I'll tell I you would, what. I would prefer... A coach in that situation to come to me and say, hey, look, your chances don't look too well. You might as well take action now instead of just let me sit on it thinking I'm fucking mm-hmm. somebody until it's too late to do dick. Yep. No, he told guess, him flat out. I guess it's just funny the way uh, he said it. Yeah. Well, oh, yeah, you yeah, know, no, it's no, just no, 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 Hop your ass in that trailer. I mean, you because you it's a train buddy with you. Bye. Yeah, this is who I feel for. Today, do you guys take offense to that? I, <laughs> just a little. No, no, no. That's you two no. freaking jackass. I, man. I, I completely. Yeah. Let me let me speak oh, on yeah. this. Who's seeing the goddamn psychiatrist? No, I, I can joking. see. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm joking. I'm joking. Bro. I can I'm, see. I'm kidding. Kidding. I can, I I can understand you, that, Dion. I completely understand. <laughs> Capitalist. I'm, I love when people can make money and he can go to greener pastures and make bigger things happen at a bigger school. Sure. But I can't also see. The kid who came in and came in because of Dion, and he's at Jackson State, and he's not going to be in the transfer por- portal. He's going to be at Jackson State next year, and now it's disappointing. We lost, you know, 60 minutes is probably not coming to the campus next year. Good morning, America is probably not coming to the campus next year. You know, Dion's not going to be around here. We're probably not going to have bigger, big enough. Bigger crowds than we do this as year. Long as well, keep, so I do feel left, for those kids, but I, under, he, I understand he left, he why left he left. He left the blueprint on how to do it. All they got to do is hire the right coach. You hire the right coach, winning, winning fixes everything. And Jackson State was not winning before Prime that got there. That is true. If they and, start if winning, they, all they and, do is and keep they buckle winning. down and, and show and everything you know, that he's done, ass. everything he's done already, he, he still left a lot of the shit there. They just mad because he left. Like, I think the most important like, thing like that he's left is the culture. The winning culture, and if they can hold on to that somehow, then they'll be fine. There are a lot of good black coaches out here that are not well, like yeah. Deion Sanders, but they are really better coaches. You True. hire the right guy, you know. What I'm saying you're gonna have to pay them. You ain't, you know, what I mean, what you can afford to pay them because they know HBCUs ain't got that much money. But you go out there not and you yet. pay them. Not, not yet. yet. You what if they get not like yet. a not yet? What if they get like a bootleg white dude that's real good? Nah, nah. For nah, like nah, real nah. cheap on the low. <laughs> <laughs> 